Hi there, my name is Dave Douglas. I'm Vice President of Advanced Technology here at Sun Microsystems. Over the last couple years, we've heard a lot of customers tell us, my data centers are out of space, out of power, out of cooling, and I'm having trouble expanding and buying into the big investment I'm gonna to have to make to grow. Other of our customers are growing so fast that they can't build data centers fast enough to keep up. So we've been working on that problem for the last couple years. The result of our efforts, Project Black Box, the world's first virtualized data center. And in fact, I've got one here with me today. Let's go take a look inside. Project Black Box is built inside a standard 20-foot shipping container. Inside this shipping container are eight 19-inch standard racks that allow us to use any combination of servers, storage, networking that a customer needs. We use standard shipping containers because there's the infrastructure around to transport them any way you want. We can move them by truck, by train, by boat, by forklift. We can configure them in one place, deliver them right to you, and get them up and running within a day. Let's go take a look and see what's inside. So to get into the container, basically we pop open the container doors, and you get a sense for the basic layout. There's two rows of racks and an aisle down the middle. To get to the aisle, we open up the maintenance hatch, and you can see down the center here and four racks on each side for a total of eight racks. We've done a lot of work to your basic shipping container. Little things like the lights that allow, allow you to see when you're inside. As you look inside, you'll see cable trays, you'll see cooling, integrated power. A lot of features that basically set this apart from just a standard shipping container with a few racks bolted into it. Let's go inside and take a look at the racks in a little more detail. It's a little noisy in here. That's just because of the wind blowing around in order to cool the servers. We've got the cooling in here for 200 kilowatts worth of servers. And all that's going through chillers that sit in between each rack. This is a standard 19 inch rack that holds 42 rack units worth of servers. As you can see, it's mounted sideways so that we can blow air through it from front to back and then immediately through a chiller before it goes to the next rack. These racks pull out into the aisle and then you can service them from both the front and the back. Well, that was pretty simple. So you might be asking, how hard is it to hook this up and get it up and running? Well, that's pretty simple too. Let's go take a look. So what's it take to get a Project Black Box online? Actually, it's pretty simple. We got cold water and hot water, have to hook those up to a chilling system. We've got standard ethernet for networking, and we got standard 208 volt three phase power to power the unit. That's all it takes. We deliver one of these into your site, you hook those up and you're up and running. So that pretty much wraps up our, our overview of Project Black Box. If you need more information, give us a call or come visit us at sun.com slash blackbox. That's pretty much it for now. Thanks for listening and we'll talk to you again soon.